Can you believe it's already 2024? We're still a little ways away from the iPhone 17 release in 2025, but there are already loads of leaks and speculations about what's coming next. I mean, it's incredible that we're already getting a sneak peek at future iPhones, but that's technology for you. Apple is preparing to release a new model that will be known as the iPhone Air or iPhone Slim. The exact name is still unknown, but this one is going to be a game changer. Consider it Apple's tiniest iPhone ever, an ultra-sleek no-frills version of the iPhone. It will have a 48-megapixel camera but will not have all of the high-end capabilities seen in prom versions. This phone will be geared for consumers who want something smaller, lighter, and easier to slide into their pocket, in fact, it may be slimmer than the current iPad Pro, making it a big contender if you value simplicity but still want amazing features. Now here's a biggie promotion display for every iPhone model. Up until now, the buttery smooth 120Hz refresh rate has been reserved for the Pro Series iPhones, but it appears that Apple is going to make this available on all iPhone 17 models, which means smoother scrolling, better responsiveness, and an overall more enjoyable experience. Apple is finally catching up with rivals who have had this for a long. The Dynamic Island is going to be redesigned and smaller. Apple is relocating some of the Face ID sensors, which means that the pill-shaped cutout will take up less screen area. A smaller dynamic island means you have more screen real estate to explore, which is always a plus. Speaking of the dynamic island, the front-facing camera within is receiving a huge update. We're talking 24 megapixels instead of the existing 12 megapixels, which is a significant difference. After three generations of utilizing the same selfie camera, it's about time Apple upgraded the hardware, and who knows, maybe we'll get some new features like center stage for better video conversations. We'll have to wait and see but it's encouraging that the front camera is receiving a much-needed boost. Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So with up and said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.